Hi guys, so in this episode we're gonna give you some tips on how to jump. Um, I'll be, I'll show you boosting today. It was looking so fun. I wanna do the same. Um, do you have some tips? Like, do you need like some special weather conditions or? Yeah, I mean, um, for sure you, uh, you know, you wanna be powered, I would say, uh, or extra powered. So you wanna be uh, going out when it's quite windy. Uh, so you wanna have, you know, like a rather bigger wing than normal. And then as far as board, I was writing this new Cabrina board, it's called Macro, which is like a, uh, you know, quite a compact board because to go, uh, you know, to boost and to jump, you want to have like a rather small board, uh, which is more maneuverable and easy, easier to jump with. And then of course on the board, I was, I was having straps, yeah, because to jump, you need the straps. Yes, exactly. Nice. Okay. So when do you feel that you're ready to jump? Yeah, I mean, um, you want to be like really powered. So you're normally like pulling a lot on the backhand and uh, you're having, you know, like so much speed that you feel like you're going to blow out. And so that's the time when you want to, you know, go for it. Okay. Um, and what do you do then? I kind of, uh, I kind of thought about jumping as a same feeling as doing it with a kite foil. Um, so it's, uh, you have to be a lot more, um, you know, like a lot more gentle on your way, on your feet with the weight. Uh, compared to riding just on the water with the board uh, because you're basically uh, just jumping off the foil. You know, these foils are bigger, so are a lot more uh, stable and easier to feel, but that's what you do, you know, you're, you're going full speed on the foil and then you're, you're edging with the foil and with the board out, you know, outside from the water and then you're sending the board and the foil against the wind and just popping out of the water. That's awesome. And then once you're in the air, is there anything you need to do? Yeah, I mean, you, you kind of want to always keep pulling with the backhand because that's where the power is coming from. So if you want to, uh, you know, like jump the longest and just come down easy, that's what you want to do. You want to keep pulling with the backhand. So you're going to also land smooth and keep your power and get going again. And did you go for like a certain style for your first air? What did you do with your body? Yeah, um, I think as a start, I, I just did like a, you know, a very basic small jump just to figure out what was happening with the foil coming out and into the water. So you kind of want to stay compact and just figure out what's happening. And then afterwards, I kind of tried, uh, you know, like something similar in cutting. There's a relay, you know, kind of sending the board back and it felt quite cool because you feel so long, you know, from the foil all the way to the wing. Uh, so yeah, it was pretty fun. That yeah, was looking really awesome. Um, okay, and then you're going down. Do you need to do something uh, for the landing? I mean, uh, you, you just kind of, uh, just kind of waiting and hoping for the best. Really, uh, you're coming down. The, wood, the foil is going under, and you try to be as, you know, as stable. And maybe you, you know, you're just gonna bend your legs to, uh, you know, have more balance. And then you want to pull on your backhand straight away to get speed and to get going. Nice. I want to give it a try too. Uh, and then once you've done the regular jumps, are there other jumps that you? Yeah, I mean. Can do? You know, there's, I think the possibilities are just endless. Uh, you know, lately we see guys doing back rolls and uh, back flips and all sort of things. So I think we have a lot of catch up to do. Nice. Well, thanks Albi. I'm gonna give it a try. I hope you too. Um, make sure to watch the next episode in which we're gonna speak about some other basic tricks. Ciao guys.